Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And today on Facebook, somebody posted a clip art like this, and they were having trouble removing the white background without I just turning all black. And I found one that's pretty close. So I think it's uh, will be a good example. So we're gonna I, I put in a yellow box in the background so you can see that it's not transparent. And we're gonna go up to bitmap and resample. And it just happens to be 300 DPI, so I wouldn't change it. Then I'd go to bitmap, outline, trace, clip art, which I use the most, and it works most of the time the best. Then you hit OK. Your your new trace will be on the outside or on the top. And if you move it out of the way, you can see a group of 55 objects. We can delete the clip art, and we'll bring this back. Now, you can't just erase the white. So we're going to get over here and ungroup everything. And you see if you take away that white, you have a back, black, black background. So that's what our problem is. We can probably delete the outside. And we could maybe try deleting that, but no, it takes it away. So what I would do is take that and delete it, put no fill, but I would put a red hairline. And then I'm going to nudge it over two inches my nudge factor is set on two inches i'm going to do the same thing on that white i'm going to no fill red outline move it over two inches there's another spot and you could do hold down the shift key and get all these at one time hopefully might miss a few and go no fill hairline and move them over and we still missed a few, so shift, I'm holding down the shift key, I'm selecting all the white, or hopefully all the white, go no fill, red hairline, move it over. We'll go ahead and do them all. Click on the white, no fill, left click, right click, click outline, move that over. Now take this item and put no fill hairline. Now I'm going to move it down and I'm going to erase all this garbage. There's some garbage on the screen that we don't really need. Now I'm going to move this back and I'm going to move all this back. And then real quickly, take your smart fill tool and fill this in. Now you have a transparent box. Whoops. I am going to take away my fill, and I'm going to select it all, and I'm going to left click no outline because you don't want it to cut out. So now you have a good clean clip art with no background, and that's how I would do it. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.